Hey, good evening and welcome, welcome to, to what match day 13? We have semi playoffs, baby. Yeah, talking about match days anymore. Have... It looks like Trident's banned nuke, ancient banned by spaghetti in our first. Pick bands are going through quick. Pick will be Mirage, then Spaghetti's pick Vertigo, and it looks like a decider on. Between Anubis and Overpass. I think it goes Anubis here, knowing. If I was a betting man. <laughs> Which you may be. Oh, I'm tense. I know. <laughs> Personally, I hope What's we get gonna to be? see a little Anubis action. Yeah, there we go. All right. Yep, the Anubis. Right all along. So we'll be... What do you think of this matchup tonight? I'm very excited for this matchup. I mean, we have UPS, the Spaghetti, which probably I would say the unanimous like, best team in the tier, right? I mean, three players, I think, with over a 1.1 rating, that's nuts. And then we have ATL, which you know, their last game was an absolute barn burner on Ancient. We saw the multiple auto snipers come out, right? That was that game, yeah. I think. Um, uh, so they seem absolutely ready to ball out as well. So I think we're in for a banger series. Uh, the... Wait, UPS. Yeah, I, it's kind of, it feels like coming into this, it, we, most people would think it might be a little David versus Goliath because I believe ATL was the lowest, uh, is the lowest seeded team in the tourney still, correct? Um, that's possible. I'm not sure. Uh, well, they they were in the they played against YC in the play-in, and won that, and then faced off against OS Tuesday, won that one, and now they're here. So I think a little that, wind that behind their sails. Yeah. But yeah, spaghetti. Yeah, three players in the top ten, actually, not even top one OKD. They have four there. Their and... fragging power is not to be underestimated, that's for sure. For sure not, but what... Trident slacks in uh, frags or maybe stats on a page, I think they make up in team play. They've always been a really good uh, strategy team. They, they threw in some funky stuff against us. Yes. The they one, matchup, <laughs> one match they we did. played against them. And I... I think the funkiest thing is a uh, stake from Jake Farm, right? I think we've been parroting this all playoffs and all season, but uh, he he likes to get feisty with a certain weapon. Yes, yes, he does. Made a bit of a name for himself this season with the auto sniper. So yeah. we'll definitely be keeping an eye out for that. Um, but it's the playoffs. Anything can happen. Um, that's why we love it. So, yeah, I think... You know, despite whatever statistical disparities there are, I think we're in for a great match. Yeah. Um, look at this match results. I. It's Trident and UPS, correct? They, I mm -hmm. think they. Trident, UPS. I'm trying to find what total. Try to get. And it went 1917 and gang. And some of the tridents after that game. A revenge on Mirage. Yeah, for sure. But I and think that's. Uh, is that what we get up first? I think so. The tridents have a late season pickup as well, am I right? In Legends? Is that correct? Or did I make that up? Yes, yes. They traded for Legend from YC. Right, right. So. Yeah, they dropped. Uh, to Jetski and traded for that in the second round. Sure to YC for 
That's another wild Legend. card in the mix. Yeah. Yeah. The Legend was the first overall pick at the beginning of the season, right? That's right. That's right. First overall. So, yeah, they've definitely brought in the firepower, made the right changes to get them uh, going at the end here. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, because they've also, they haven't lost for, they're on a one, two, three. I guess this is their first best of three. So they're a three map win streak right now? 